To re-enable F8 button in Windows 10, you would need to re-enable what's called legacy boot menu policy on your PC. To do that, you would need to launch command prompt option and execute command. To re-enable old style F8 boot menu options, you need to change boot menu policy to legacy. To do that, you need to navigate to the start menu and launch command prompt as an administrator. Once in the command prompt, you need to run this command. I'm going to copy it from the clipboard and then paste it right into command prompt. The command is bcd edit slash set and then default boot menu policy legacy. Basically, we're switching our existing policy, which is new for Windows 10, into the old boot menu policy, which is now called legacy. Once you run this command, you need to restart and hold F8 button. So I'm holding F8 button right now while Windows restarts. And now you see advanced boot options with a lot of choices. You can go into the safe mode, safe mode with networking, command prompt, boot logging, and uh, a lot of other options that's available. If this video was helpful, make sure to click the like button in your browser. Also, please help your friends to learn this topic faster by sharing this video with them. And if you would like to be the first one to know about new videos to help you reach your goals faster, make sure to subscribe to my channel. Make sure to check out my other relevant videos and subscribe to my YouTube channel. We have a lot of great stuff planned in the pipeline and I don't want you to miss any of it. And if you'd like to get notified about all the new stuff that are coming out, make sure to subscribe to my email list as well. All links are here on the screen. Make sure to click to stay in touch. Thanks again for watching.